Today's video, we're gonna be watching a gold game, a gold bingo at that. Here is the summary. It's the end of the season. All your comp games are all over the place, and to top it off, it's 5 a.m. on the weekend. This game is probably one of the most scuffed games I've been a part of and competitive and included an interest in play or two, an ambitious res, and my DPS happily yelling at each other in voice chat. I'm not the best support player, but I've been trying to rank up a little bit before Season 5. Doing so in the middle of the night wasn't the best idea, though. In my opinion, this game was probably one I wasn't doing as well on compared to my earlier games. It kind of seemed more like a bronze-silver game rather than a gold-plat game, so I hope you potentially enjoy this monstrosity. Here it is. This is the card we got. Honestly, I didn't edit any of the stuff, but I see a Reinhardt. We know there's gonna be a Mercy. Here we go. Hold it close. Totally fine. So far, everything seems fine here. And yeah, this is Bingo. Okay, here we go. <laughs> oh, that was great. Oh yeah, DPS. I mean, we already we already can check off DPS exactly where they're supposed to be with that one. Actually, you know what? We'll do that right now because it's a good way to showcase why it is. Because that widow is in the right spot. Where is it? There it is. Perfect. Oh, the Rhine Shield broke. Oh wait, did it? I'm gonna be honest with you. I forgot that was even on the bingo card. Chad, thank you for letting me know about that because I forgot that was on the card. Okay, here we go. Off to a good start. Okay, the healing orb on the ground. You know where that's gonna go? Did it actually did it go up to the skybox? No, it actually did it. Oh, maybe it healed you for fall. Maybe that was good. Also, I think this is a good way to describe how this game is gonna be so far because we have a Reinhardt up here, a Bastion right here, a Roadhog flanking, while Mora doesn't care about the Roadhog flanking, a Simu has now become the tank, and a Widow who is just kind of playing on the low ground here, getting used to the new patch uh, next week. All right, here we go. Back to the Moira. Oh, yeah. Yeah, okay. Frontline support? I can't disagree with that. We got a frontline support. Oh, actually, Ryan doesn't shield teammates happen to. Okay, we're good to go. So far, interesting start. Widow's top left. Widow is being pinged. Oh no. Oh, the 1v1. Oh no. Oh, this is a good one. <laughs> I love that it just started with you dying a double sniper like five times. Okay, good news. Bastion does have all. Oh, wait, I gotta see this. I gotta see this. Oh, the I was gonna say that the Zarya doesn't shoot the target. Here we go. Be careful with your position in here, by the way. You don't have your cooldowns, and like you're by yourself in the middle of points. So if you use fade in front of there, what the? All right, very aggressive tank is checked off. Okay, let's head back to this now. Ah, that wasn't a Venn diagram, all by the way. Oh, big slam! Huge. Was that a zero limo? Oh, did the Bastion all get zero? Yeah, we can do that. Uh, I'm sure we're not missing too much on this one. Oh, I gotta fix my sound for a second. All right, okay. So just to make this very clear here, there's three of their team, four of their team, and you're ult in by yourself on point after they use the grab. Let's see how this goes. First of all, we have a big slam from earlier. Second of all, we have Alton after a team fight is one slash lost. All right, this is a good one so far. We got it quite the game. Yeah, whenever you're using like your fade, you end up kind of going to the same spot or like to a spot where they're at. I'm watching. Okay. Taking the scenic route back to point. Huge dragon, shouldn't get anybody. The junk rat now. Ryan's purple, Ryan charged out. Your, your, your sim is now the main tank. Your Sim is now the main tank. Good job getting the Venom Mine. Huge wall. On a miss nade, it's time to go in. Huge! Yeah, you can't, you can't, uh, that, that's too far out of range. Oh, this is amazing. Okay, this is unreal. Thank you for this. That was, that was, that was amazing. Thank you. Your Ryan likes to charge in. I respect it. I respect the play. Sip 
for the parched. Uh oh. Uh, remember what we talked about? Remember what we talked about? All right, we need to talk about this. First of all, I am checking off ability used before or after it should have been used. There, there was absolutely no reason to Moira fade five feet in front of your Reinhardt into their team. I would not recommend doing that. You think you enjoy hitting the melee button here? Oh, wait, you can use your damage orb a bit more if you want to. No, no, here we go again! It's happening again! Look at your positioning! No! No, stop going in! I swear if you all. I have a question, chat, and I need to find out here in a second. Is this happening again on King's Row? We need to, we need to go back a second here. Did it happen again? Surrender to my will. I saw it on the kill feed and I was thinking maybe the junk rat was like disengaging. You know what I mean? Like maybe the junk rat was disengaging and backed up right here where we've seen people fall off the map. That was the la the last thing I expected. Anyway, yeah, uh your ultimate was was something, to say the least. Here. Yeah, a lot of the time you're going in to try to save your Ryan. Like, if your Ryan's in their back line and you have to, your fade is going to put you in the middle of the open, not near your Ryan or behind their shield, it is not worth doing that. T is very nifty. All right, here we go. Yeah, that, that heal one is doing a lot. Here we go. There's a damage orb. It's what I'm talking about. Look at that. Look at that. See? Ryan LOS it honestly. We can probably check that off right now. Someone keeps LOS in the heels. We're just gonna count that for Ryan. This has been just an unreal half. It's been awesome. This is an alt domino coming up, by the way, chat, because you have to use all your ults, so I think we might count it. And no, we won't. Alright! Well, that was certainly a half of Overwatch. Let's double check here, chat. Look at the bingo card. Tell me if there's anything we're missing. Everyone's on the objective. Happened on first point. I forgot to check that off. I feel like the whole team was on the point. Uh, we haven't had a Mercy yet, but apparently there will be some Mercy gameplay. Um, we don't have a Zenyatta, so Tank can't get destroyed. I don't even know what I just said. Tank can't get destroyed by Discord Orb. There hasn't been a Venn Diagram. Huh? We haven't seen a Diva. No one's gone randomly AFK. Long 1v1. You know what? We'll figure it out later. No one shoots the Taurus. People are shooting the Taurus. Mercy revives someone immediately fall over. Haven't done that one. Then we haven't had the one bottom right where team gets on the objective. We got a Mercy. Will we have a battle Mercy? Will Mercy fly into the enemy team? Will someone get revived and immediately fall over? We're about to find out. I love how they ran double sniper, and this Farret has found a way to take as much damage as possible. I just had to stop right there for a second. All right, we continue on. All right, here we go. Oh yeah, what now? What now? Battle Mercy? We need a Battle Mercy here. Battle Mercy. You shoot a bullet at him, we get, no, we don't even get a Battle Mercy. If you shot one bullet at him, we would have had Battle Mercy. We didn't even get that! Wait, 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 wait. Chad is right. Wait a second. No, Chad is right. Battle Mercy! Shot the Venom Mine! That is a huge pick! Good call! Battle Mercy, good call, chat. Okay, a nano pharaoh with damage boost. 
I love your commitment to flying on the ground into the team. And I love that it worked. I love that it worked. You said you'd argue that one? First of all, we all know that getting a pick on the Venom Mine is a huge play. All right? Coming from somebody who normally just gets Venom Mine with Diva, oh, we know how huge it is to get that Venom Mine. All right, let's continue on here. I don't know what it is about watching everybody get one shot by Widow this game. Then randomly AFK. We can we can do that one. I, I, I think so. I think that we don't count that. You know what? Because why not? Mercy flies into the enemy team. Did happen. This one did happen. Remember when the Mercy flew into the ground at the point nobody attacked the Mercy? That it was into the enemy team. So we will count that one. So Pharah Mercy here. Actually, can be pretty good in a second because you can go over that. Oh, yep. There we go. Heroes never die. All right. Well, that is a easy Mercy revives in the middle of the team right there. That's what we love to see. All right. Here we go. Now, we need the Pharah to fall over immediately. Oh, it didn't happen. Imagine. Hey, the res was worth. Listen. The res was worth. Rez in the middle of the team, won the team fight, and then randomly went AFK. So if we question the randomly AFK earlier, we now know that's officially randomly AFK. That's a wall. A lot of ults happen right now. Are we getting an ult domino? If we get a nano or a careful ult, I'd say this is close to an ult domino. I haven't seen it yet. Team's having a pretty good attack so far, though. And heal. Perfect. Fox playing aggressive. Nice point. Nice point. Is it time to go in for the res again? Nope. We got an ultimate. Yeah, just go this way. Here we go. Huge heals. Huge ult. You don't try to res that, do you? There's no way you're trying to res that. There's no way you're trying to res that. It's happening. Is it happening? No, it's not happening. Wait, is it? Oh, no, they spawned. Huge foul. We got, we got one ult, we got two ult, we got three ult. We got four ult. Come on. You know what? I'm going to count this as an ult domino. We didn't get nano, but if... Oh, here we go. Oh, yeah. Wait, do you not... Are you not shooting a bullet there? Did you try to melee the, the echo? I, I, I... All right, well, um, we got the ultimate domino, which gives us another... Bingo. Oh, imagine if Farrah got sucked off the map. I don't think we have broken keyboard on the uh, on the bingo card, but there was a broken keyboard. Wait, do we have Diva ult? Wait a second. If Diva gets ult, there could be a Diva pack situation here, chat. Could happen. Hey, Diva's at 90%. Eve is at 92%. Come on, Diva. We need this on the bingo card. This is gold. If you were the Mercy, you were to push her off the map. Yeah, the Farrah could have flown up at that point, though, right? I think. Mercy? I'm so confused. Wait a second. That Ana had no idea the Mercy was there until the Mercy moved. I actually think that Mercy could have stayed there even longer. It's amazing. I'm, I'm loving this. Ladies and gentlemen. Oh, we get a tire. A 
Are we getting a diva ult? Is it diva pack time? Is it diva pack time? I have to watch. Is it diva pack time? Is it time? Is it time for the diva pack? Alright, no it's not. Back to the mercy. You got this, Diva. You got this. I, there's no way that gets anybody. No, I was gonna say, there was no way that that wasn't even close. I like it though. That would have definitely been the Diva pack. Okay, here we go. Huge res! I'm sorry, what? Did you just cancel the res on accident or did you get oh wow? I can't tell. Did you get javelin? Did you cancel the res? I, I can't tell. Oh, back to Moira. Uh oh. Wait a second, the Diva Clutch. The Diva Clutch. Wait a second. Heels in your teammates while a soldier runs at you. Uh oh! This isn't looking the best for your team. Wait a second. How do you win this? Oh, there we go. Huge pick. Huge pick. Chat team is getting close to home again. Don't fade into the team. Okay, one thing you can do a lot of is you fade into the team. I know you got away there, but like, think about. A little bit better positioning. Like that. Don't that right there? Like I don't uh oh. Is it Venn diagram ult? Do we have a oh. No, it's not. They actually ulted correctly. What's going on here? Okay, it's a diva ult! Come on, diva pack time! No. Huge ult! Come oh, on, there's no way. There's no way. Your team managed to cap that point. And one thing I will say, how do they get to the point slash survive? We're going to check that off at the beginning of that team fight because honestly, it looked like it was lost. There was a lot happening there, especially when they used all their ultimates on you on point and they didn't get the Olympus. Two, a team fight that could take a really long time or a long team fight absolutely happened. Both of those checked off. Okay, oh, Winston. Winston, okay. Interesting here, yep. Okay. Oh, damage orb! Let's go! Nope. Wait. Hey, you can't DPS the Widow all the way up there with your right click. Your range is not that long on Warrior. You're kind of like randomly using your heals. Wait. 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 Cap the point. That was a little bit better of fade. There's a Lucio, yep. And now we're into the overtime part of the game, where everybody randomly runs with a cart because it says overtime, it doesn't try to regroup the whole time. Your team has mayo. This could go really well for your team. Yep. Yeah, we might have to do that if we know it's going to be an overtime game. Because it happens so much. It's like, oh, it's overtime, I must now run at the cart. Any teamwork is out the window. It happens all the time? I, I, it just, all the time? Oh, it's overtime? I'm not gonna regroup. Do I have longer spawns? Yeah, but you know what? What if I run to the point 1v5? You have almost every else. It's time. It's time. Yep, that's, you know what? That cut of the limb. Huge! Yeah, oh yeah, a lot happening here. Yep, yeah, oh yeah. Wait, you clutch this? Or no, you don't clutch this, right? Okay, so this is where you, you, you hold that, right? Oh, 
Okay, I was gonna say. Okay, not a bad push. You gotta say. Nope. Okay, I had to double check. They're out of range. Okay, now they're in range. Your Ryan is out of range at that point. One thing you're doing a lot of is you're kind of just using your heals randomly just to use your button. You don't have to do that sometimes. Also, your damage orb during that downtime can be used to also build up your charge. As you see, it's building up your charge a little bit. And speaking of charge, your Ryan's going in against a Bastion comp. Wow, what a treat that was. Awesome. Okay. Um, I don't think your team's holding first point. Do they think you're a part of their team? What is... All right, here we go. Will your team win this game? Will they not? Be careful. You're also, look how much healing you've used without healing anybody. Keep that in mind. When you play Moira next time, focus on that a little bit more. If you do play Moira of like how much you're healing that's not actually do what the rhyme oh this rhyme what is what's going on here this rhyme is just going in wait one second there is no way that you just won this game there is no way oh my I think we know what time it is. Could have touched, easily touched. They could have We got another bingo. Was there a Venn diagram, Bastionel? No. Did the tank get destroyed by a Discord orb? No. Was there a Diva Pact? No. Was there a long 1v1? I felt like that whole game was a long 1v1. Why not check it off? No one shoots the turrets? I have no idea. Mercy revives someone and they immediately fall over? Honestly, half the revives you actually accidentally cancel and they get anybody with it. So that was great. Also, when you're playing Moira, try not to heal absolutely nothing. And what I mean by that is you spent so much time using your healing resources, healing nothing, and then not using a damage orb that you constantly were out of, like, your resources. Next time, focus more on healing your teammates when they're in range. Remember the range that you have on right-click. Use your damage orb more. Damage orb gives you resources back to be able to heal people in front of you. With that being said, we didn't quite get the bingo card, but this was a game that felt like it was the whole bingo card. You know what I mean? Like, this, it, it was almost like it was a completed bingo card, but it wasn't. So... I hope you enjoyed this video. That was a ton of fun. Per usual, you can submit these games on Discord. Go to the YouTubes. Hope you all have an amazing day slash night.